and just kept working on it from there. Here, back to D, which is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That's my D major scale. And then the fourth up from the D is D, E, F sharp, G. It's the same pattern for the G scale. And consequently, the C is the same pattern again. I get, so those are the easiest keys to play in is D, G, C, and their relative minors like A minor or E minor. And then it gets a little more complicated from there like my A scale is. It gets a little more bizarre. Do you play the piano as well? Uh, I do a little bit. Okay, so that's how you kind of, uh, the logic of the piano? In a sense, yeah. And then these are like chromatics over here. So kind of, in a sense, I should say in a sense like the the black keys of a piano, but not necessarily because I, like I have an F sharp there, I have a C sharp. So I don't have to jump to those to play a major scale because it's all right here. So I don't have to use any uh, so-called black keys to do those, those major scales.